Salute and welcome back to Unknown Soldier Radio. And I'm Dog Tags. The power of walking away is the greatest power slash superpower that you didn't know that you possess as a man. What do I mean by walking away? Well, simply put, walking away, pointing your feet in the direction that brings you peace. I don't care what the situation is. I don't care what the situation looks like. Walk away. It can be a job. It could be family. Mother, father, sister, brother, auntie, uncle, cousin, friend. It doesn't matter. Walk away. If the situation and the circumstance is taking away from your mental stability as a man and the inability to properly process decisions as a man walk away. Sometimes in life we lose sight of ourselves and we forget oftentimes more than not that we are spiritual beings and I'm not going to tap into religion or what you believe whatever higher power that you believe in and if you just believe that there's something greater than yourself that exists Know that God or your personal higher power is not the author of your confusion. But sometimes in life, we want to snatch the pen from our Creator's hand and write our own story and become the author of our own confusion and as it relates to men's mental health and the space that occupies our mind should be clear should be free should be at a point where we're able to make decisions knowing that they're thought through thoroughly as a boy as a man as a king as a god you cannot make decisions with clouded judgment and as a man we are born with an innate desire to want to take on the world and shoulder the world's problems and problem solve because after all we are problem solvers that is why we like to feel needed and without the need and the ability to problem solve that kind of defeats our purpose and being men so when you hear phrases like I don't need no man or a woman needs a man like a fish needs a bicycle not only is that counter biological it's counterintuitive and the brain is a very unique organ in the human body as it has a way of identifying and remembering things based on sight, touch, smell, or even hearing. 
especially something that is in contrast with our human nature as men. And while I'm not going to get into the complex structure of the brain and its anatomy, there's one particular part of the brain that is just a magnet for pain. And it's called the hippocampus. It's located below the frontal lobe, in the temporal lobe, and the hippocampus has a major role in learning and memory and in those memories and the learning process it remembers pain associated with everything we've learned and everything that we remember so why would anybody in their right state of mind no pun intended disrespect the hippocampus over and over and over again it makes no sense. Walk away. <laughs>